Hello all, welcome to Global Offensive Hacker Associate Community. In this episode, we are going to learn about DevSecOps. So you can see, okay, the terminology we call as a DevSecOps means development, security, and operations. Okay, so if you want to uh, define this particular defin definition, you can just check this particular part. So you can see, okay, like uh, DevSecOps versus DevOps. Okay, what do you mean by this? So when you talk about DevOps, okay, first we understand what is DevOps. So DevOps means okay, development, operation, and application delivery. And when you talk about DevSecOps, we talk about okay, that security in this case. So security is one of the extra part okay which we have to add it here okay in the case of DevSecOps. It means development, operation, application delivery, and security. So basically, this particular okay uh, program we can say DevSecOps okay is a part of continuous integration and continuous delivery so generally basically we will understand okay two uh, terminology first what is continuous integration and what is continuous delivery and then okay security right and then we talk about the security part it means security you have to add it okay in this case so what do you mean by the continuous integration and what do you mean by the continuous delivery let me explain first okay DevOps. then i will come to that point okay like continuous integration and continuous delivery so DevOps isn't just about development and operation team. If you want to take a full advantage of agility and responsiveness of a DevOps approach, IT security must play an integrated role in the full life cycle of your applications. So here, okay, the term we use called as agility. So what do you mean by the term agility? So agility means, okay, like the ability to move quickly. Okay, kind of, okay, you can see is a kind of automation. So agility, it is a like cloud word and we are using, okay, agility word many times okay in the cloud computing part and cloud computing we are already aware about this right what is virtualization what is hypervisor what is a storage technology what is an open stack we have seen about the management plan we have to check about uh, the aws right aws google cloud azure there are many okay vendors are available for cloud also and we have done okay many lab okay in our previous sessions let's go to the devsecops so how would you define devsecops so security is included okay in the DevOps culture so that the business value is delivered with the lowest risk. The merging of development and security team for coding into production. However, the DevOps should be dealing with the security. DevSecOps is just about incorporating security into DevOps at the beginning of the software development life cycle to bridge security and agility. As I mentioned to you, we talk about okay more on the agility side, it means the automation and uh, we are adding okay security in DevOps. okay we call as an devsecops okay this we call it devsecops so in the past the role of security was isolated to the specific team in the final stage of the development so if we talk about the past okay what we were doing is okay we were different different team okay for different different tasks like for one team okay for web application task, one team for okay like uh, cloud computing task one team for the complete management task many things like that okay so you can see these are all isolated part different team doing different activity but right now the current age is the automation so everything is like automated right now right so example let's say if you go to the like aws if you need okay right now example let's say i need a okay, 10 virtual cpu i need okay like uh, two terabyte hard disk within a second i can get okay like my resources whatever i want it okay from the particular infrastructure so I can easily get it okay this is called an automation okay we can say it's kind of orchestration so there are two word okay here we call as the one is abstraction and second is the orchestration so abstraction okay we talk about mostly on the virtualization part it means first we virtualized everything and then we automate okay this is called abstraction and orchestration so uh, this is a diagram okay you can check it out okay like what we want to say is this so dev sec and the ops the development security and operation right so now in the collaborative framework of DevOps, security is a shared responsibility. So as we already know, okay, like the cloud, okay, like work based on the shared responsibility model. Same way, okay, like when you talk about the DevOps, security is always a shared responsibility or um, like you can see here as you can see in this particular, okay, like definition. In the collaborative framework of DevOps, security is a shared responsibility integrated from end to end. It is a mindset that is so important it led some to coin the term DevSecOps to emphasize the need to build a security foundation into DevOps initiative, right? And it means like what you will do, what I will do. Okay, this is called a shared responsibility model. 
so here is it. okay now you can see the together okay like we are working and we call it and dev secops so as i mentioned to you, okay here okay we have two terminology as we have to understand okay one is called as continuous integration and second is called as continuous delivery so continuous integration means okay like what actually so generally okay there is a main central uh, central repository okay uh, where okay we have a like all developer okay will okay like write a particular code and okay and we'll test it properly so example if you want to check it out i will just show you okay here okay the image so you can see okay this image will explain everything you can see we have a first phase code build integrate and then release and then deploy this is all okay we can say the phases right so when you talk about okay from code to the integrate part okay this is called continuous integration when you talk about okay from code to the release part is called as continuous delivery and the last part we can say is called as a continuous deployment okay so we can say like uh, before delivery okay everything okay we call as a continuous integration part so what you can achieve with this so this is the you can uh, check it out this is the important part so this includes uh, source control repository container registries the continuous integration and the continuous deployment we call as ci cd pipeline the application programming interface management orchestration is automation and release automation and operation management and monitoring so when you talk about okay like dev secops you just understand about this part like environment and data security second okay we talk about ci cd process security so what is environment and data security so standardize and automate the environment okay this is called environment and data security second part when talk about ci cd process security so integrate a security scanner for the container isolate the container running microservices from each other and the, the network add automate tests for the security capabilities into the acceptance test process encrypt data between the app and service so as we know okay like uh, cryptography is the main part okay in this case okay we should encrypt everything okay if you're talking about security so data should not leak okay from the particular place that's why we call as encrypt data between the apps and the service so automated security updates such as patches for the non vulnerability so we are already aware about okay this part right okay like we have exploited many vulnerability regarding to this like security misconfiguration when we identify some version okay we will check in vulnerability databases like search exploit okay exploit db security focus okay cv details okay nvd national vulnerability databases and then okay we search for the version vulnerability and we're going to exploit it right so here okay we have to update okay means the patches so automate okay security updates uh, then okay we talk about okay like introduce secure api gateway so what is api i have already video recorded you can go back and you can check it out okay what exactly is an api but here okay i'm going to describe what exactly the api is okay it's kind of messenger okay is a kind of messenger for example if you book the particular ticket okay like uh, example it's a flight ticket and you go to the go ibo right so simply okay you go to the go ibo or make my trip you book your ticket okay and then okay example let's say you'll see the indigo okay like button okay example let's say you book the flight for indigo so automatically okay when you book the flight automatically the information will submit okay to the indigo okay this is how the api work okay it's kind of messenger okay from uh, everything is automated okay they will call to the uh, other api check the functionality everything okay and then okay you are, you are giving something of all the information and then again is executing the task this is called as an api this call is in so we have to check for what we have to check for the insecure api part okay so api nothing but the messenger okay from one end to the other end okay simple that's it this is called an api and uh, we have a very uh, many uh, labs are available okay in our challenges section you can check it out and you can try to exploit the api then the last part okay we can say is called automate the system and service configuration management capability so i think if you heard about okay like ansible these are all okay example of okay we can say for configuration management we have a chef we have a puppet okay these are the example of configuration management so you can check it out okay in this case so here okay i'm talking about the introduction of dev secop okay our main part is not to understand okay like here okay right now the left side of other thing a simple uh, like introduction i'm i want to give you a complete overview of dev sec ops so now after the ohc okay program when you finish your training okay now you can decide your career in which field okay you want to take expertization if you want to go to the dev sec ops okay is excellent career okay in that if you want to go or if you want to move to the cloud pen testing you can go for the offensive cloud pen testing program if you want to go for malware analysis reverse engine then go for the mar mare there are many okay like domains you can check it out okay, in our website there are many information okay like we have 
already eaten okay like for our uh, the student so this is about the cicd and uh, let me go to the top okay i'll read okay here this main important part so what about the understanding the it security so it security is an umbrella term that include network internet endpoint api cloud application container security and more it's about establishing a set of security strategies that work together to help protect your digital data not so long ago it security was a checkpoint at the end of the development cycle so as i mentioned to you okay like here okay we're talking about a okay, click like past how we are working and right now okay how we are working so past as i mentioned we have different different team right now everything is automated okay and when we adding okay security okay in devops operation okay we call it in devsecops so there are three part okay one is called development second okay we have a operation and third is we call it in security and the last part okay which i am going to discuss is called as a container security so when you talk about the container the container okay, we got uh, we are talking about okay called as in docker so docker is a we call as a host based virtualization okay is a container technology i am going to record okay one more video on this okay what is container how we can work with the container how to uh, download the container okay in our ubuntu system and how to play with this okay so i will teach you some like uh, command okay to handle the docker images so this is about the container and we talk about okay like what exactly is this container security in our next section this is all about okay devop i hope this video is informative for you thank you for watching the video have a great day ahead